What's up everybody? It's the Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video outside this morning, feeling this cool weather, and I'm thinking to myself, what's going on, particularly with Highcroft, like I showed y'all before on a five minute chart that when you're looking at the price action is not moving, then you could basically say that's an unofficial halt, that they are not letting the price of a stock move. Simple as that. Now, the other day we had a run up for AMC and GME ran up to 35 and there were two halts in, that, in those run ups. And people were making reference to other run ups like Centerworld who ran up 198%, but then they didn't get halted. So what's going on? People, it's all perspective, like I've tell y'all every video just about. If you look at it from a different perspective, you'll start seeing what's really going on. What they're doing when they are halting these stocks is taking away the sell button. The sell button, not the buy button. I heard one YouTuber make reference to the halts meaning that they're, take, they're taking the buy button, but eh, they're taking both buttons actually. But most importantly to them, they're taking your sell button. They don't want you to be able to press your sell button. Why? Because with over 4 million, 5 million, 6 million people in this play, all at different price levels, a lot of them are really low price levels so that when we run, they can't afford you to hit your sell button. So what are they doing? They halt the stop. They stop it from running up. Why? Not so that you can't buy, but so that we can't sell. Now, we're not going to sell at 20 for AMC, and we're not going to sell at uh, 15 for 8. But there are a lot of people in this play that got in at two and three dollars and not below two dollars. And when this motherfucker runs to twenty dollars, they taking their profits, people. I don't blame them anymore. This bullshit that we've been in, <laughs> if we didn't have no idea the shit that they would be putting us through with this stock. Still in it, and I think we could still win. But what I believe has to happen is enough people will have to sell out at a lower level which will open the door for the stock to be able to run up. Because as it stands right now, it can't do it. Because, because as it stands right now, it can't, it can't run up like that. They can't do it. Why? Because if it runs up to just $50, do you realize how many people are going to hit the fucking sale button, people? And the brokerages would be crippled at that point. That's the reason for the halts. Now, you ask one of these so-called financial fucking guru pieces of shit that's been trying to advise us for the past year and giving us wrong information. <laughs> oh, they halt the stock after it moves up a certain percent. <laughs> Bullshit. We see they let some stocks run up a thousand percent. So there are no rules in the stock market anymore. The simple fact is this. They don't want you and me hitting our sell buttons and that's it now take that and think about it for a little bit and get that down into your spirit that these people could care less if we spent the rest of fucking eternity buying amc it's like a big fucking abyss that you could just keep buying more and more shares but they can't have you sell them now, some of the smarter YouTubers might put together where I'm trying to go with this. Uh, I'll give y'all a chance to meditate on it and think about it. And maybe you'll get the concept of what I believe we could do to make this motherfucker squeeze or bankrupt them either one. We'll talk about that at a later date. Love y'all. Be blessed. See you in the next video.